2020 has been a crazy year, but uh, I think we're really in for trouble now. Uh, there's some sort of bright yellow orb floating in the sky. Uh, I did a video last night basically trying to explain the wiring of the tether switch and explaining that I think I've figured out what the starting issue with the X2 is. So I'm going to very quickly try to sort this out and if I can get it running fairly quickly, dependably, then I'm going to take it out on the water. And my relay wire comes up and connects right here. So that's why it's not starting. So, all right. I'm pushing the button and nothing is happening. So I now have this ground wire going to the negative on the battery. And it is connecting here with the ground from the coil. Now that I've connected that ground wire, I should be able to hit this button and it should turn over. Oh yeah. I like being right. It is about 4 p.m. So I uh, still have a bunch of daylight and it's fairly warm today. We have had some pretty poor weather recently, so uh, it's nice to actually have the sun shining. Anyway, I'm almost there, so I will see you guys in a minute. And, uh...
think it's starting more reliably, but uh, yeah, it seems maybe like it's a little rich on the bottom, but I don't really want to start leaning it out before it breaks in. It could be partly due to the porting that I've done to it, and uh, it could be jetting, it could be all the oil that's in there. It's hard to say at this point, but uh, I'm going to keep riding it. The battery's at about 10%, so I'm going to replace the battery. <sighs> oh, my keys are in my jet ski. I'll go get a battery after. <laughs> YouTube. So the uh, X2 is starting fine now. I've got rocks in my shoes. I do know that, and it's very uncomfortable. <laughs>
Well, it's still having problems, but uh, it runs. <clears throat> oh, these rocks are slippery. Not filling with water. Well, that's good. Let's see how much fuel I have in it. About a third of a tank, I guess. for the night. <laughs> oh no. Oh no. I was gonna try to go into shore and move my lever and some. I left it loose enough I could move it. There we go. Alright. I think I'm out of the weeds enough that I can huh, stir it back up. Uh-oh. Did my switch come on? No, nope, it's still there. It feels quick. That's for sure. I don't think my hood seal's working very good. Holy shit. All right, it's not too deep here. Wow, I need to uh, fix my hood seal apparently. I'm okay. was a bad idea not to glue this hood seal on, wasn't it? Thank <laughs> you. 
seriously going to end up back in the weeds. dropped a cylinder or something it started running really really rich or something something's not quite right so I think what I might do is back the truck in and uh, pick it up and then sit out of the water for a while warm up I might take it back in I might not 